You're like way taller than me. It's because I'm sitting on a higher chair. Yeah, you are. I look so short. You are. You're a little mutant midget leprechaun. I'm a leprechaun. Like a Yoda leprechaun. Pinch me, you will not. Okay. Yeah. Hi. I'm wearing the same shirt I was wearing yesterday. This is my official contest garb. I don't care. We're dirty, scummy people. We're wearing That's the same shirt. That's what it is, yeah. We're dirty, scummy people. Hashtag Markwood video magic. Exactly. <laughs> so here we are with another installment in our great contest extravaganza. Mm hmm. Boonski. Boonski. 2014. 2014. St. Patrick's Day. St. Patrick's Day contest, contest extravaganza. extravaganza. Yeah. Boonski, etc. Yeah. And yesterday we went over the first mm -hmm. part, which was uh, performances. Performance and, and entertainment. entertainment. And arts. And art. And stuff. Yeah. That's something that's important to us for St. Patrick's Day. Um, and today... Food is important to us yeah. for St. Patrick's Day. I always make a traditional Irish meal with traditional Irish foods. <clears throat> not corned beef and cabbage, because that's the Americanized St. Patrick's Day food. If you go to Ireland on St. <laughs> Patrick's Day, the only people there eating corned beef and cabbage are tourists. Yes, the Irish Because it's not a things. it's not an Irish dish at all. That's something that was started over here in America. They have meat and potatoes and cocannon and box tea and lots of stew. Stew they do shepherd's stew a lot. pies yeah. or all that good stuff. So um so that's the kind of stuff that we like to eat. Hold on just a minute, ladies and gentlemen, I'll be right back. Uh oh. Okay. Uh disaster has been averted. Yes. Okay, so I think we were talking about food. Yeah, food. And we, <clears throat> we generally... Traditional Irish food rather than corned beef and Yeah, <clears throat> we generally have a meal for St. Patrick's Day um, that we try to eat traditional food. Um, last year for uh, CAPS, we had, after the CAPS meeting, we had the guys over back to our house, and somebody made a huge spread of uh, traditional Irish food, and... Full disclosure, after we just uh, beat them up about corned beef and cabbage, uh, we actually did have corned beef and cabbage as an addition to last year's meal. You made um, shepherd's pie, wasn't it? I made shepherd's, shepherd's pie, pie and, and uh, uh, coal cannon yeah. and soda bread mm. and all kinds of things. Yeah, so we should, but we, uh, <laughs> we, we weren't sure if we were going to have enough food for the entire pipe club, so just kind of as a last minute easy thing, we threw some corned beef and cabbage in the crock pot. Um, but yeah, that's normally not part of our no, traditional meal. So, so that was last year uh, at Caps. This year, we want you guys to show us what you do for St. Patrick's Day. Whether you go out and you have a traditional meal someplace, or if you make something yourself, um, probably try to stay away from the corned beef and cabbage. But if you can't, that's fine too. Just go ahead and put that in your video. So it can either be you cooking, or eating, or going someplace or whatever, but show us what you do for your food for St. Patrick's Day. Share with us a meal. If you go out to eat somewhere, maybe to a local Irish pub or something, uh, you can show us that. Uh, you can show us a recipe. Mm -hmm. If there's, if it's not a whole meal and you just want to do like one dish and show mm -hmm. us how you make whatever. you know, Maybe there's something that's been passed Irish down student. in your family because your family is Irish and this is there what your grandma taught you how to make or something. Share that with us. So uh, keep in mind that uh, everything, all the rules and everything of last, yesterday's video, it's all the same all for the same. today. So um, so keep in mind that we are going to be uh, judging. Yeah, not random drawing. It's it will be based on the content of your video. As many entries as you'd like. On you can enter as many Instagram times as you want. And YouTube. Yeah. But um, but yeah, it's not going to be a random draw. Mm -mm. Um, so. Be mindful of what you're what you're putting in your videos. Remember, in your Instagram stuff, you need to tag one or both of us, and you need to use that special hashtag, which is uh, Boonski, Boonski Saint Pat, Pat contest. contest. Right. So, and if um, you're doing a video, that you email the link to, to boontarskipsy at, at gmail dot com, uh, and you have to be following both of us and or subbed to both of us on whatever platform you're using. Contest runs through two twenty eight fourteen. Yeah, all of February basically. If you're in March, you're too late. Yeah. <clears throat> eighteen and over, you gotta be eighteen and over. Open to all inhabitants of the planet Earth. Yep. We'll International ship. accepted. 
will ship winners internationally. And or at least their prizes. Or at least their prizes we won't ship them. <laughs> I'm, I'm not paying to ship some here. That's crazy. Okay, so I hope that's kind of clear of what this today's contest is about. Yes. Is so now on food. to the important stuff like prizes. So here's the prizes. We have a, another whole prize pack. Yeah. Another imagine that. Whole prize pack. Wow. That has different prizes and, and some of the same similar type prizes. prizes. Um. First of all, let's show them the things that they already saw from yesterday. Okay. So you're going to be getting a copy of the Clancy Brothers CD from yesterday. There you go. Same same CD as we showed yesterday. You're also going to be receiving the Irish Toast number no. 22 from Jonathan Want. Jonathan Want sent that. You're also going to be receiving a tamper slash snuff spoon slash scraper from uh, Nate the Nathan Great. Campbell. Nathan Campbell. Yep. You're also going to be receiving your very own Lucky Shamrock. Aren't these cool? I, I found these and thought, you know, I want this for our contest. This was at like a little, what's the paper store? It's paper like a, Yeah, it's like a little Hallmark store. And they had these things there. I know that was so cool. I hope you guys... You get a lucky shamrock. I hope you guys like this as much as I do. I just thought that was really cool. You also get a green <clears throat> snuff hanky. Yep. Or a bandana. So you, know, you can wipe your little Irish toast boogers. <laughs> you also get a sample of Nottingham Lace Rouge, courtesy of, of Jonathan Want. Mr. Jonathan Want, with yep. his horrible pictures right there. You and also get a pipe pouch uh, that I made. Full disclosure on this one, also, this is actually the same pipe pouch from yesterday's it's video. Possibly not the pipe pouch you'll receive. <clears throat> right now, um, we have one pipe pouch made. Uh, Skipsy's going to be making some more, so your pipe pouch might be a little bit different. <laughs> Sorry, there was a cat on my at the table. <clears throat> so your pipe pouch might be a little bit different, but this is... The cat was not harmed. I threw it and hit a garbage can because yeah. I knew it would make noise and scare All right. me. <laughs> so you will get a pipe pouch made by Skipsy. Okay. It may look like that. It may be different. So You're also is, going to this receive... Is this is different from yesterday now. <clears throat> this is from Mr. Jonathan Want also. You are going to receive... He sent us... A clay pipe. So the clay yeah. pipe? Clay pipe. This is my pipe. It is a lovely pipe. Do you like my pipe? So you're going to get a clay pipe. And you're doing a little leprechaun smoking a little clay yes. pipe. And you are going to receive, because it is a food themed portion of the contest, this is the cookbook that I got recipes from for my meal last year. This is my cookbook. I'm giving it to the lucky winner of this portion of the contest. It's called Irish Pub Cooking. That is the official Skipsy. Uh, Irish cooking cookbook that Vegetables she's used to make food for Look, us. Irish stew. Irish stew, there you go. And it's got all kinds of corned beef and cabbages actually in here, and I'm sorry. But <laughs> Just all kinds of good stuff in here. I love this this cookbook, but I'm going to give it away in my contest because I thought that was fitting. There's the, <clears> there's the coal cannon. There's the coal cannon recipe that I used. It's <clears> even <throat> got some residue on it from where I cooked. <laughs> right there for you guys. Look at that. So this will be sent out in your prize pack to you, and... And if you want, I might even be able to talk Skipsy into writing a little note in the in the book for you. Of course there oh. will be a note. Oh. I always write notes in books that I oh. use gifts. Oh, what is that? Finally, you will yes. receive... Yes, what? A, uh. a, an estate grade... Ooh. Peterson pipe. Another Peterson? That has what? been restored by Briarville Rick... It's a <clears throat> diamond shank bulldog shape. Let's see what it is officially. It's a 150. It's a 150. I've been talking I think it's the... Uh, it's a Shannon. Shannon. Yeah. 150. Shannon. Look at that. There's the P right there. Well, I know it's, it's a, a 150. It's the same shape as the racing green you yeah, got me. Yeah, uh, it is. It is the exact same shape as the racing green. It's just a different color. So there you go. There's so, a Peterson and a bunch of other fun things for St. Patrick's Day. For St. Patrick's Day. Now, remember... This prize pack may uh, increase in quantity yep. and value. <laughs> yep, we're actually we, we have a few other things planned that we're adding. as the month progresses because we do have some other things in the works already, and you guys just wait and see what we've got up our sleeves. Yeah, some hairy armpits. What? So Ew, just, gross. He has hairy armpits. I don't have hairy armpits. You don't need own. to know about people's armpits. This is a <laughs> contest video, not armpits are gross. <laughs> but they're funny. Armpits are funny. Oh, okay. So, 
Go ahead and show us what you do to eat for St. Patrick's Day. Food, boys and girls. Food. I know this will pique some food. of y'all's interest. Food. food. Get out there and show us what you munch on. Yeah, make some food food. for us. Show us what you got. And then uh, maybe you can win something to figure out some other uh, things you can make. Expand your menu. All right, guys. So that's it. So now we've got knocked down entertainment and performance arts and food. Food. All right. That's it. Let's see what tomorrow brings. What? Tomorrow? What's going on tomorrow? I don't know. Hey folks, uh, just a brief addendum onto this. I wanted to uh, let you guys know for sure. Also, um, I know not everybody in the community is is you know as talented in cooking or preparing meals or whatever. But I also know a lot of us have spouses, so um, that is definitely allowed. Uh, if you want to have your spouse um, helping you with the video or uh, even if they are preparing the meal or recipe, uh, if they're doing all the work, you know, that's, it's fine as long as you are also somehow involved in the video, you know, being a part of the video. If you're, if this is going to be your entry, you have to be included in the video, you know, maybe narrating or, you know, or uh, helping out or whatever, you know, you do have to somehow be involved in the video, but, um... Hey, if you if your wife or husband or boyfriend or girlfriend or whatever is better in the kitchen than you are and and better at cooking stuff, and you want to uh, include them uh, in helping out with your contest entry, go for it. We are totally okay with that. So, all right, good luck, everybody. I hope you're having fun. We'll see you.